All right, if you watched yesterday's video, I adhered crackle paste to Nara paper and a canvas. So this is day one. It's not been 24 hours. Um, they do, do say to wait two to three days. And my air must be super dry right now um, because I've got some pretty good crackles going on here. Can you see that? So this is the Nara paper, um, but a problem. It's not actually adhering. And this is an experiment because I've not tried, but look at that, that whole piece just come right up. So I'm not sure what to do about that. It's not coming up over here. It is down here. So maybe it has to do with the no, nope, it's not the thickness that I applied it. Really interesting. Um, I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to do with that. If anyone has any ideas how I can adhere it, does it make sense to pick it all up because you've got all the crackles, right? Or maybe I just take it off, um, which I guess I'm not super opposed to, but I don't know if flooding it with some sort of glue because it would go between the cracks or what. Right, I'm not opposed to adding more texture to that. So that's this one, which I'm actually super excited about. I think I like it like this. Um, and then this is more what I'm used to. This is acting more like the, um, and I've told you I've put crackle paste on cradle board before, and this is on a canvas. That's a cool texture. I don't expect this to crackle on this side because it is so thin. But you can see here, I've got it nice and thick. They say 1 16th inch. And I've got some nice texture going on. I'm imagining this to be a landscape and I'm going to do water and I'm just kind of see, see what happens as I start to lay inks down. But anyway, that's what I got. This is day two. I am going to let it dry one more day. Um, before I start adding alcohol ink. There we go. See the cracks? 